We've received questions. Shona, you get questions. Mm -hmm. um, is it usually cleaning questions that you get? No, I get everything oh. under the sun. You would everything. everything. Okay, yeah, yeah. Well, all this across is, the board. This is good. You're open to whatever. So yeah. we're going to take a look at your first question. <laughs> My swimsuit drawer is a mess. Oh, mine too. Yeah. I just can't keep them organized. Please help. Shones, do you have any advice? Well, I called you Shones. She didn't. Yes, no, no. <laughs> That's Rita okay. Rita was like, That's Shona, okay. a lot of people please do. help me. Yeah. Okay, most people, yes, swimsuits are terrible. The straps and sometimes two pieces, you know, sets yes. of their bikinis, yeah. one pieces, et cetera, and extra things like rash guards. Anyway, yes. most people, mine used to, like years ago, uh -huh. look, my bikini bathed swimsuit drawer looked like this. It's all a mess and you have to search, okay, I found a top, now where's the bottom, totally. right? There is a better way. And the better way is to ditch all this, uh -huh. clean out your drawer, and then for every swimsuit, give it its own little bag. Oh. You can buy these little Gosh. clear bags on Amazon for really, really inexpensive. Okay. Like you, you generally buy them in packs of like 10, 12, 20, you know, okay. depending how many suits you have, you know? Yeah. But I think these are really handy just to have around in general. I use these type of bags for a lot of things. Yeah, absolutely. So you're putting your bikini in a two piece, you're putting your bikini top and bottom in the bag. Mm -hmm. And then as you put them in the drawer, they stay organized That's and one so up nice. so you can pull them out. And you, I highly recommend that you use clear bags so you know what's in it. Yeah. I'm looking at this, I know it's my body glove rash guard. Right. So I know this on a really hot day, I wanna pull that out. Totally. Or it's my polka dot bikini. And yes, there's enough room in these little bags. They're like for cosmetic bags. For cover-ups, yes, but also one piece. Like one piece swimsuits, yeah. you add a ruffle. <laughs> Yeah. They're, they're big. There's a lot of material in those. Totally. And depending on how many suits you have or how many uh, bigger drawers or whatever, buy the bags that kind of suit that. That's so good. Did you, so do easy. you do the bathing suit try on every time before you go away? Because I do. I'm oh, like, which yes, one can I get to pull? I yeah. love that part yeah. of it. Yes, yeah, it's exciting. Yeah, just right? try it's them the on and then that, you know the ones you want. I bet you love the shoe part too. I love the yes, shoe yes, part. Yes, yes, yes. I, I really know Tracy do. more in the shoes. Yeah, okay, we have another question for you. What are your best tips to keep your floors clean? This is a good one. and we're we're always on top of the floors. We both have dogs. Yeah. Like it's it's an everyday struggle. This is it. I, I've got this question so many times. I was like, okay, we finally have to kind of just address this one. Mm -hmm. And you you just said it. I'm sorry, but it's just daily maintenance. It's every, there there every isn't day. a magic wand when it comes to that. Daily maintenance, really really quick, mm -hmm. and then you don't have to do the big cleanup. But. Right. There is a tool. This is uh, Bana, which is a floor cleaning company. Okay. They have this spray mop, mop. and we they do uh, dry floor mops and ones that don't spray all the floor cleaners. Okay. But what I like about this one, these kind of spray mops have been around for a bit, but this one is so much better. You know how things as as products kind of come along, they get, they better, get better and better. And better. Yeah. This one is better, it's really sturdy. The old ones, the handles were all kind of wonky, they didn't really push. Yeah. The head on this is really big, so I don't have to go back and forth the same spot 12 times to cover like one foot radius. Yeah. It's a really wide head. The Bonna cleaner, you fill it, it comes, it comes with a cleaner, but you fill it with your own. All natural, plant ingredients. We're working smarter, not harder. Yep. Safe homes for the little ones on the floor, whether it be children or pets. Mm -hmm. You know, we want to think of those are our feet in our bed. Yep. And all you do is pull the lever, it sprays the flooring, and oh. wipe back and forth. Look, oh, look at that, actually. That's good. And I will tell you, like, as you know, I do test a lot of these things. Yeah. And I'm gonna tell you the Bono by far was the best cleaner. The, the spray mop is the best spray mop, and then the cleaner on its own is the best. Okay. And I do wanna say, when you're thinking natural products, you do not wanna use like that water and vinegar. It's That's a good cleaner for a lot of things for a natural cleaner. It yeah. is not good on your hardwood floors. Oh, really? Absolutely do not use it on your hardwood floors. Okay. You want a hardwood floor cleaner for that. You could use the vinegar and water on tile, yeah. vinyl, something like that, okay. but definitely not um, on the hardwood. You wanna get a really, proper hardwood floor cleaner for that. And that it only takes a know. minute. You do that every time there's a spill or anytime there's some paws walk yes. across or whatever, yeah. and, and you're done. It's not a big deal. I love that. And we're doing it already, but it's all sloppy with the mop we have. So yes. this is gonna make it neat and tidy and quick. Yeah. Yeah. And the yeah. best part about all of this is our audience is gonna take home this amazing Bonna mop and cleaner. <laughs> Did I say it right? Bonna, yeah. Bonna. Yeah.